Oh, good morning. Uh, Sorry about that. I had to change the link though. No, that's right. So, which one is? Who do I share this? Just say uh, it's, it's, it we'll needs to be changed too. Um, you know, I just do copy link and say that that work is it. Um, it's not shareable, so yeah, so I need to go post it. Yeah. Yeah, maybe hit return. It will. Uh, good morning, uh, Sean Partridge here with Scotty Fraser, uh, just for our mic'd up doubles. Uh, my partner's Cooper Bolton, and uh, Scotty's partner is Mark Owens. Just doing a few final things. Hey, Sean, how are you? Good, mate, you? Yeah, very well. That's the way. Just sharing this to the Facebook page to try and stream it a bit further. And yeah, this is good. Let me know when you're ready to start talking. Oh, are we not on yet? Are we not on now, Danny? Oh, I just did a beautiful good morning, everyone, and intro it. Oh, I think you're on. Okay, yep. cool. Here Excellent. Let's do this. All right, let's get down in. Yeah, good morning. Looking forward to this. Scotty, I'm gonna send it, I'm gonna send Cooper in for the leg, mate. So yeah, no problem at all. Mark, we're, we're live now. If you want to share that to your uh, to, to your page, it's uh, it's just went up one minute ago. Sorry, excuse me. You're right. Yeah. So for anyone that doesn't know, we're uh, we're gonna try and give you a, that's the one there. Yeah, shot by shot insight. Try and explain what we're doing. Um, yeah, and give you an insight. If it's execution you're looking for, maybe. Maybe not uh, best watching me here, but uh, while we're on the visit, we'll be able to talk about what we're doing. Uh, we've cleared it with a head referee chase, so uh, when we come off the table, Sean and Cooper will come on the table, and uh, we'll sit back and we'll just try and go through the thought process uh, while trying to roughly guide the one-minute shot clock bit with around that. But yeah, excellent, Sean. All, all the best, mate. All the best, well. mate. Yep. Marty, you lag, huh? You lag, so we lag, we lag for break. break. Mark will lag with Cooper, I think. All the best, Cooper. Come up. And it's uh, closest to the top rail, best obviously. Best. Well. Wins the break. Cooper looks pretty good. Mark a bit heavy. All right, mate. Make him up. All the best, lads. All the best, mate. Play well. All the best, Cooper. Let's go, mate. Great break, break, mate. Great break. All right, let's discuss. Let's have a quick look here. How are you feeling, mate? I like it a lot. I really like the look of reds. Uh, we've got this ball over here. So we've got, we've got to be precise on this one here, but I think the rest of them are pretty good. Um, let's. All right. I'm going to start. I'm going to start with this one, all right? And then we'll come to the middle of the table, probably for the, the one here, all right? So I want to get to deal with that one next, okay? Let's, let's get started, all right? Let's go, mate. Next match in the Masters Pairs, table number seven. Yeah, seven. Kennedy and Swift versus Percy and Johnston. Touch. Come on. 
Let's go, mate. You up first. Let's go. We're behind these two anyway, and obviously a trouble. There's obviously trouble there. Yep. 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 What are you going to do with the other red here, Mark? Are you thinking about popping that other red and trying to nudge it up? Or are you going to stand and try and leave it in the screen? You're going to, just, you're going to play through it. Play through it and leave it up here. Yep. So what do you think? Do you try and just leave an angle to take that pot on? Or do you try and just nudge that over the pocket to just to take, the, take the pocket? Maybe maybe play it maybe play it soft enough that if we miss it it sits over the pocket. And then obviously you want it, you want to spring this ball out. This obviously goes there and this goes. So if you want to be aggressive, I don't mind taking this pot on. I think we've got the angle for it. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yep. Definitely. Yep. I like it. They've done their one discussion. We are able to execute this one. Some great breaks from Cooper in the start when we went first look at the balls. We've sort of broken down a little bit midway, but I think we're still in a reasonably good position. They've got a bit of work to do. First shot in the morning. Next match of the men's pairs, table number. Five. It's a great shot from Mike Open. Norton and Smith against Johnny and Malchenko. Not perfect. Let's try and drift up the two of them. Yeah, that's right. Got a couple of difficult balls here on the rail to deal with. Um, we'll be precise now then on that, but they're maybe, maybe going to play off it now. No? There we go. All right, Coop. Let's work through this, mate. Let's work through this and let's make sure that, yeah. Just didn't get across that one. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to have to take the one over the pocket, I think, because... Yeah, and then play the plant. Oh, but this one goes here, right? Just coming in here for a sec. We want to be probably... We probably want to go, yeah, so here, then to the plant, so we've got this one to get on, because the other ball's going to be on here, right? So. That's right, mate. Don't stress. There's no um, we light off the chance there. <coughs> Definitely. Yes. Yep. You do, now just obviously it's all about your pace here. And you don't if you if you want you're going to be catching that yellow full ball. So you're going to try and promote up here. I guess if it goes towards the black, it might put, make it a bit sticky. Yeah. Just try and get it, get get it through. Get it through. Yeah. Try and miss the first one, get the second one. Any contact on it should be fine. Just make sure you get it through to get the white spin off a bit more. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. If, if, if the black's going to carry into the yellow, and if anything's going to walk towards the middle anyway, we've always got that red to use as it's the big pocket to the middle as well. So, yep. 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 Mark usually very good at these shots. So. Good cue action. He just strikes through the ball quite well. So. He's just looking at the red first side, yeah. it's like the second one. Hope to look at the front side. Just caught the ball, yellow first, which makes this a bit tricky. Let's um, try to do it straight on the serve, but it's landed a little bit tricky. And it's got the long one, but it's got a cut. It doesn't go to the corner. Yeah, it's tough a little bit to do. do. This is a uh, tricky cue in here. 
It's something to enjoy is for the time in the morning. Obviously, they keep holding, which is amazing. Good shot. It uh, plays right to Mark's little house. Next match fantastic cures and a great long potter. So this is bread and butter for him. This one here. On table number nine, Sebastio and Sailor versus Smallwood and Fong. Put a bit more pace in that one there just to try and make sure they execute the pot. I want to take the nerves out of the shot. Great shot, great shot. Just gonna roll this through, make some easier shot. Yep, just roll it through. Need a cut to the middle. We finished, boys. Well done. Well done, Cheers, lads. All right. Where you sit? That's our break. Yep, our break. You break. I'm relieved of breaking duties as of now, man. Yeah. So Scotch Devils, you can. Uh, I used to think it was uh, auto open at breaks, but it's not. It's actually uh, you can pick anyone to break. So. Mark's got a stronger break than me, so it makes a lot of sense for Mark to break. <coughs> Gets through the ball a lot better than I do. Disappointing to drop that one, I think we had the chance there. It's a tricky sort of plant red. When Mark played the shot, he left the red tricky. Maybe plant but tricky for Cook there. Uh, just missed it. Right, Coop, first look again, mate. Let's, let's have a look. Oh. I like that. All right, my first instinct, mate, is yellows. What do you think? Okay, I've got to play the one in the rail first, all right? Okay. Shot, shot.
Next match in the men's pairs, table number 10, Reed and Priest versus Brown and Walpole. Half a ball off position or something. Two, it's all going to fix it up. Creates a problem. Nice um, I'd nearly. Try and run the first ball up to the top with a bit of, of follow through to make sure you cover the yellow. Yeah. And then you put a snooker maybe off the top if you can. It's a tough shot. I don't know if I've got a nice angle. I'll just have to. I'll try. Yep. Just have a look over here. It's going to sort of pop out. It's going to pop out, Mark. I play at the top. It's going to sort of pop out to here. And you're not going to get a nice angle or sort of roll it. And you know the other thing I could try and do, I don't know if I miss it, I could try and stun this one across. And it gets rid of the hard one. Unless I just come off the side of the, the side of the red, try and leave the white up the top. If obviously that yellow doesn't go to either pocket, you see. So instead of trying to pot that plain ball. Yeah, that works. That works. Yeah. Do it, do it in a way that you're leaving this in the open. Yeah, I don't need too hard and bury this one as well. Yeah, I do need to get the cue ball sort of up here, though. otherwise it'll be an easy hit. Are you coming here with it? Are you coming here with well, it? Well, I was going to come here with it because I don't really want them to have a shot, a shot on the ball. What do you think? Is it, easy, is it more of a thing to promote? Should I even try and pop this thing? And then you can flick off the side this one and maybe come in behind here. I'm queuing I'm queuing over. I'm queuing over the red. It's obviously for me it makes it difficult. Whatever, whatever you're more comfortable with, if you want to just flick it off and leave it here, or if you want to go for the pot, I can try and do, I can try and do that after. I can actually leave this cube, I can play this with follow through, take it out, I think, take it off here and leave it in the open, and I think I can get the white up, up here yeah, behind the ball. Even, even if you don't get it there, I can take that one. Yeah, okay. You got the point safe here. Where we play with that yellow is probably minus. Slightly playing safe. Oh, no nudge. Didn't judge that well. I double kiss. <laughs> um, <laughs> I'll look at them, I think. Just play the train. You know? um, I, try, I can try I can try and cut this in, the one in the middle. It's a fucking big shot. And probably the red's going to help us hold, but it's a big fucking, it's a big shot. We need something, don't we? I don't think there's any value in any particular save to me. We could play, we could smother a little bit more, but it's only going to be time to snooker us, it, snooker us to death, you know what I mean? So I'll try and cut it in. Oh, a shot. Oh, Sean. Mate, Apologies. we needed a rub there, didn't we? It's Apo very thin. Apologies, Sean. I thought it was Cooper, but I saw Cooper in the shot. <laughs> <laughs> That's very thin. It's been unlucky, yeah, I think. Yeah, it's it's half, half, half more overall than a minute. It's not frozen, Mark. So obviously, that's the... That's the snooker if you want it. Uh, it would be nice to promote that red, but I mean, at the end of the day, getting the snooker is the most important thing. With the two shots, yeah. we can try and promote it. Uh, with the two. Would you like to? Would you rather play into? It? Would you rather play into it with the red, and, and see if you can develop it, then see if it's snooker after. It's, it's all about leaving a tough one. See this side, the these balls here, the black and the red, stop the natural escape for the for the yellow. So as long as you're not leaving them anything here where they can squeeze off the inside yeah, of the pocket. Yeah, develop it and then we'll see if we can play a snooker. I'll try and leave the white. It needs to be somewhere up here because we can't disturb that. And defence mode here. Yeah. Alright, so we're uh, yeah, we're we'll whip you, aren't we? Trying to win the game. So. Uh, we'll I think they're going to look to pot and then play a good snooker, I imagine. Get the furrow. 
Just hopefully get the two shots and clear the pocket. I dare say wherever I'm going to be here, it's going to be ugly. <laughs> Just trying to make sure that I don't leave any easy chance for the yellow one. I'm also trying to promote this ball. No. Looks like it might be time for me to uh, channel my inner Peter Butterworth here. Just want me to magic something up. <laughs> should, go, should go into the jaws in the bottom here. I'll see Gareth posted all the time in his videos. Hey? <laughs> Gareth Potter does it all the time on TV. <laughs> hey? should, be, should be easy. <laughs> I like this one better. This will be good. Well, I potted it. <laughs> Caused a bit of chaos. Sorry, mate. Now I, yeah, I want to have a crack at the one the other way. <laughs> yeah, that, I like that one better. Yeah. Actually, in this in this instance, I'm going to ask you what to do because you think it's difficult to come from the water. Well, well it's it's quite an easy one actually. Uh, I don't mean to sound funny, but all these balls are in the open. Yeah. The black's also pretty good. It can go in either pocket. So if I was you, I'd uh, ask for ball in hand. Yeah. I'd stick the white here. Yeah. I'd just flick off the side that red. I'd just promote the red off the bottom pocket cushion here and somewhere up into the middle of the table. And the white balls is naturally going to come off the side cushion and come over here. But so am I right in saying this is the link up to the black into that corner then? Yeah, I yeah. mean, I mean, yeah. So I mean, out this one, this one, bring it up here. Yes, and yes, one. yes, hundred percent. That, that's the ideal. That's the ideal way. Yeah. Uh, if anything goes wrong, I mean, we can still get onto the black from these two balls. We should be able to find a nice, a nice angle. We are trying to leave that till last, but if we have to, we'll put, put uh, pick that one off. We'll come up and we'll try and just leave us something nice. Just perfect here. I mean, we, we, fa we fancy ourselves from there. The, the obviously, member ball in hand, and then the first shot's obviously the crucial one. Try and leave that. Next match in the, the Masters pairs on table number six: Cottingham and Satrick versus Jeffries and Carlisle. Marcus is going to try these two shots. Leave the black where it is. Flick off the red. Yeah, great shot. Yeah. Shot. Would you set a free shot there? Angle here so we can come back up the table. Sometimes in the past I've got these wrong, so I'm just going to try and stun it back, leaving the an angle and come just back up. I think I've played it pretty well. Interestingly enough, Coops, we, um, we've, had, we've had first look both right. frames. It's really only a couple of little mistakes has cost us, so it's been in our control to fix that other. They're not, they're not demoralising us, we're just making top. mistakes, that's all it is. So we can fix that. I like things to be within our control, it's good. So get ready for, I don't know, they'll probably make this dish, so we'll just get ready for our break and start again. Yeah.
Break up. Now break, right? Oh, do you mind, reckon? Put on. Thanks, mate. I'll bust. Good shot, man. Well oh, it was just a wee bit of a. It was just a wee bit of adrenaline in that shot because the pockets are playing so tight. Yeah. I just, I don't want to, you know, I've been cheat, trying to cheat the pockets this weekend oh, and they've been spinging yeah. back out. It's just, tight, yeah. yeah, just with that little bit of, a little bit of anxiety in the arm in the morning. I don't want to kind of over, over, under hit that or over hit that. It had to be. It's an easy shot, like but obviously at that moment. Just start mixing up big man. <laughs> Oh, we don't know. No, we forgot the scoreboard. Dan Lynch has just Dan Lynch has just pointed out we forgot the scoreboard. <laughs> asking the right, asking the right fella. <laughs> no, no then. <laughs> uh, I like it. I like it. Sorry, Coop. Great break from Sean. <sighs> Shields, Santa Chair, Meredith and Green, please, table 16. So, uh, yeah. Probably the one. Question for you. The one that comes in, mate. Sorry, mate. Previous one? Yeah. Uh, is it reset? I think we I think it'd reset again, yeah. With the traffic, too. Um, straight away, I could think. And, yeah, loves it enough music. Yep, keep going. Mm -hmm. Probably. That's. The yeah. This one's not easy as well. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Two shots with the three yeah. with the three shot. Yeah. It's, it's, can, we, can we use oh. the first shot to <laughs> develop this? I'm just trying to think: is it a way that we can play the yellow, flick off this yellow? You know, maybe even like a soft stun, where you come here and you play the yellow down to the bottom rail, and you come across and you just flick the yellow away, and then I've got two easy ones here and here yeah. to start. The yeah. black goes. So I think, and you. you I know it's starting to make that easy, but maybe just something like, maybe something like just a wee off the bottom cushion and just nestle into that. Uh, I, th I think that's, yeah, yep, I'm happy with that. And then, and then that gets, yeah, yeah. Primarily I'll go for this one. Yeah. Pro pro try and bring this one back up. Yeah, we, we really want to just make, you, you need to be hitting that, that, uh, that red. And then you've got a good chance. Beauty of the free balls that we can, we can try and promote this. It's good enough. Great shot. Good use of the free shot there, clearing the one ball he was needed to clear. It's good enough. The rest of them roll there. So. There and just just got him. Wasn't my best shot. I did a bit of double kiss. Didn't commit to the shot. Ideally, we want to take that ball at the top, next to the black, and then left middle from there. We don't want to leave that to last. I might try and leave an angle for me here. I'm not sure if he's seen it. Yet. I was trying to do that in the last shot. Never executed. Well, so far we're in a, uh, in a three mistakes, potentially three frames lost, but it's been, we don't have control to turn that around. Just got to count the mistakes. Keep it left on the side of us. We're still going to get, get these two. Yeah. Oh, 
I don't know if it's the cable is off at the beginning. Matt Connor, Sean Ledston, Rob Fretwell, Gary Cummins, please. Table 12. Well done, there, boys. Oh. Yeah, it's your bet. It's a game of fine margins. Three mistakes, three nil down. That last shot from Mark there was uh, played a lot of left hand side. Uh, obviously. Mark at a good level, he's very comfortable with that shot that I'm not too, uh, not too keen on. And, uh, leaving Mark that angle there, I thought he might just nip that white up, but I suppose there was a lot could go wrong. And he uh, very confident with that run inside to come back over and leave me a good angle for the black. Just having that extra bit of uh, skill in the army is... Uh, Help us out there. That was a good break for Mark. Big break. Big break. Break, man. Right. So obviously we can talk here. In this shot. And once this visit's over, if we sort of continue on, that's when we can't talk. Hmm. Yeah, a little bit. That red down there beside the black. That red at the side cushion. Do you know? Oh, it's a pity. I could run that. If that yellow wasn't there, I could run this yellow down. I feel like the yellows would be better trying to split that yellow up. I don't think the yellows is an easy start. I could get this yellow, but I, I could get this yellow. I do fancy myself for it. But then I, maybe we could come back up and split that off the middle yellow. But reds. Does this red? Does this red cut? Do you know what, man? This red cuts. This red cuts here. Yeah. I wonder if I cut that. Goes off the air. So it does. Now I'm going to go in off here, so I've got to try and play this with. Oh Jesus! Left hand side means I'm risking going into that yellow. Oh no, the yellow is going to stop the off. I don't even look at that. I might have to try and play this a little bit. That might the yellow might promote towards the pocket or the. I mean, still be on both colours. I think I'm going to have to. I have to go for this. I have to go for this with full commitment. Let the, let the white just do its natural. I don't think I don't want to pot it any side. I'll, I'll probably miss it. Uh, run into this yellow, and then who knows? If, if the yellow goes in, in the end off to the middle, we can then take yellows. And if it doesn't, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah okay. Yep. Yeah, okay. I'm just aware of the shot clock here. I better. Oh, well, they had to sort of forced to get rid of it. They didn't have an opener, did they? Obviously, they got uh, one ball really to deal with. The one in the bunch.
Oh, he's human. It's not a bad leave. Okay. Yeah. We've got. Okay. So what I'm thinking. Play this one. Play the skill shot. Okay. Then this one in the middle. Oh. Then we can play the long one and dislodge them then on the three. Okay. That's sort of the map I'm thinking. So one, two, three. Here. Just with a sort of bit of angle. Stun, just clear this one out and come back to here, you know what I mean? It'll open it, so just, but you, we've got a choice. Do you want me to play the skill shot? Or do you want to play the skill shot? So you, you, can, you can open, open with this one, just screw back to there and get me straight on this one, then I'll play the skill shot. Right. Love you, mate. Cooper's like showing a skill shot here. Showing a very good cues as well. So fancy for this. I nearly spoke then, I won't be honest. <laughs> hey. Shawnee, Shawnee. So we'll um, move this out now. Probably haven't. Probably been a little bit focused on the uh, executing the skill shot there. I haven't given him the ideal white, but uh, I think Coops will reimagine what the original plan. And uh, probably they probably look to go into him actually. They probably look to go in there. Just not happy about it. But, uh, I like his confidence here. It's a long one. You can either take the one in the middle and just nudge into the bunch or he can take the long one and leave me on the one at the edge of your to the centre. Either way, I'd be happy. Whatever shot he chooses. Um, shot, Coop. Shot, Cooper. actually got choice of two here. We can play the one in the middle and come to the ball line or he can play the long one. But, um, both would be both would be uh, acceptable and reasonable. So bam down to what he's more confident with. Um, to be honest I'd like to see him playing that shot now. I mean, he's from where he's standing just to um, just to knock that one in but he's waiting for the opponents now to be able to move so which means he's probably gonna play the one in the middle which is fine too as long as he gets me past it on the right angle. Do with that. Hmm. It's a bit tricky for me now. Lucky shot. Great effort, man. Yeah. Oh, mate. Um, yeah, Coops, wrong side of me there. And I decided to... Uh, I was going to play that softly and leave it near the rail. And leave him long. But I thought, no, I can probably swing this around and get him closer. I still fancy Coop to get this, to be honest. At least I hope he does. Hello, mate. I thought you might, 
I thought you might have, so you might have played the, in here in the corner. It's me to go yeah, first. Man. It's up to you how you feel. The I you could. Uh, there's two options it. here. That's all. We could play the. We could pick the white up. I think and put it at the top of the table. Just to make sure I get Play the red down on the red. Yeah. And the other thing we could do, I could. It depends how you're feeling. You obviously you. Your cue action on the left handed. I could stun this red up towards the top pocket. Just leave you an angle here. If you fancied screwing this fucking red. Oh, pardon me. Apologies for the uh, yeah, apologies yeah. for the bad language there. <laughs> she just uh, drifted off for a sec. Screwing this red down and leaving yourself that angle to come back up to the top. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's a watch it there as well. Uh-huh. I don't mind that, but what happens is if we, if we lose the first ball, if you lose the first ball and it doesn't pot, it can, it can land awkward. So I like the idea of you playing the left-handed screw back up the table. I was literally just, just play that one nearly, nearly dead weight, so you leave this kind of in around the middle of the table. Just yeah, so okay. I don't have to come all the way back up, I can leave the weight just here, and I can go this one, this one. Okay, so you just want me to almost play it dead weight just at the angle, just off, off here, or dead weight to the top? No, 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 just, just roll into almost dead weight. Yeah, and then leave you just off, just off the cushion for your. Okay. Break the rest of the match, to be honest with you. I think you've bit more control. You've got a bit more control. You break than I do. Meant to leave him a bit more of an angle there. Just sort of came across the ball and threw it across a bit. Mark likes these ones though. The trademark friend. Ooh. Commentator's curse, I think. Ooh. Second prize. Damn it. Uh, I think that's on my side. Sorry, It's my shot, isn't it? Yeah. yeah I can see it. Okay, cool. Can I have Corey Power and Josh Mooker to the top table, please? Yes, Hello, Coop. Coop. Here we come. What am I? Your bus. Yeah, I wouldn't leave right, you, but so I left um, you bad. I uh, tried to come cross. off the cushion. Do you want me to rack? Yeah, yeah. Apologies for the bad language again there, folks. That was my, uh, that was my natural, that was my natural uh, chain of thought coming out. <coughs> yeah, mate. We're in the match still. Never out of the match till time. The reds obviously. The reds obviously better. We finish it's just how do you want to deal with this? Uh, how do you want to deal with this one here? Do you want to play the yellow from here, full ball, and just bring it out to the middle, and that leaves you the red? Yeah, you could do that. Um, you could maybe do a shot in the way and kill one of the yellows. The only other, yeah, yeah. It's, oh, you, the other thing you could do is you could roll the yellow here. Off the bot, the side cushion, in towards the other yellows. Only problem is, I'm worried about uh, going towards the black and then covering the black. Uh, do you know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. You could even pot. You could even pot the yellow if you wanted. I don't know. The two yellows down here are killing. Cool. Corey Power, Josh Mooker, table hard, fourteen, problem. please. I'd almost be tempted. To, I'd almost be tempted to take that cover first. How about we just take the two shots and get this red out? Okay. Yep. Yeah, yep. you just leave me, leave me something nice. Get that red out here. Leave me something nice. Make sure you leave me a good start. Easy, good start.
I've got a paper to do here. Um, I, don't know, I don't know if this is ideal. than ideal so we're gonna require two good shots to to finish this. I think Mark will be forced to play the one on the ball line. Yeah, just because of the angle of the tender ball. So. and screw into the gap. Yeah. I think he's got more angle than I think I think he can screw towards the pink spot here to be honest. There's a lot of good results if he overheads it too, like you know. Lovely shot Scotty. Lovely shot. It's ideal. Finish, boys. Well done, Mark. Right, so we have two, um, have two dump wipes across us, haven't they? Yeah, a couple of mistakes, not much in it. These boys have played pretty clean pool. Um, the only time they've led us back to the table, we've managed to get the frame back, but uh, it's. Uh, Got it's pretty happy. Sean's listening, so I don't want to say my next comment. As long as, long as I'm no English, I was going to say. But then I saw that tattoo in his arm yesterday. 
Scotty's picking on me for my tattoos. My 18 year old tattoos. <laughs> Okay, here we go. And discuss. Okay. Um, what do you like, Coops? What do you like, mate? <laughs> you like yellows? And how are we going about it? I like this one, mate. I like this one. Off the cushion. The trees are only two different, we can go about Yeah. All right. Oh, me? Okay. Right. Coops throw me under the bus. Throw me under the bus, Coops, that's good. Um, probably, yeah, well, it's one of those outfits, it's probably the key shot, just drop this one in the middle and um, just dislodge, separate those two yellows on the cushion and make them both on. Let's go, mate. Shot, shot. Keeps leaving me a little bit more angle than uh, would have liked there, but um, it's okay. We make do. The tricky ball is the one on the uh, from where we're standing on the right hand side of the table. Need to be ideal on that one. The most precision ball we've been. Ourselves a bit too much angle on a couple of things. We're kind of lucky here, Mark. Uh, obviously, Most more of, balls need to be going in the pocket necessarily, but they've got covered. So we've got the two problems up here. Yeah. We've got the problem in the top there, beside you. We could develop this problem by obviously just playing an easy snooker in behind it. Uh, whether that be advantageous or not, I don't think the natural comes off. I think the black stops the, the cut to the middle. And obviously, that then would leave the. It's actually not a bad shot. It doesn't leave an easy get out if we get behind the, uh, the red. I think as well. Unless he comes off the top cushion, aren't you? Obviously, we're at our yellow, so uh, mm -hmm. the one there is my cue. Um, the only pocket that goes through is this one, so it might be an idea. So, over here, if we, if we do mess this one up, mm -hmm. that's very easy to get to. This one's easy to get yeah. to. We can dominate this pocket as well. Yeah, so you're quite happy with that then? Just say, uh, I'll play, the, I'll play yeah. the ball down the rail. We'll just take, take a look at Yeah. I don't mind that. Obviously, if I don't get it, but yeah, it's, it's, if, as long as I slow roll that, and then, and, you know, worst case scenario, if we do have to play these, these two plant, and I fancy yeah. us to get that to the top. Yeah. Actually, if we get a good shot on this, obviously this one here next to them might open it up, and then it's just a case of getting an angle on this. And with, with being four one up, maybe we can be quite a bit more aggressive. So that's what I'll do. I'll try and slow roll this one down in a way that if I miss it, I'll uh, leave it over the pocket. Skill shot of a different kind. Mm. 
Mm. Uh, keeping a positive mindset. Um, yeah, they're, they're lashing here, so uh, there's this bit, this a bit to do with the ball on the top rail. So we get another great opportunity here. We, we seize it. 4 2. Yeah, it's uh, not out of it yet. Make sure it is now, okay? I like your first. Okay, I'm going to take that one in the middle, yeah? Happy with that? Or you want to go another way? Middle, yep. Middle, middle. Choice. Lovely choice. Well done, lads. Well, mate. Good choice. Really good choice. You won the large shot. Yep, that we, we broke there. Mark broke drive. Right, drive. Okay, yep. yeah, break. Yep. Right, you want me to break? Just going back to that shot from Mark there. Uh, obviously, I said yeah, I said Mark he'd be, he'd be disappointed with that one. Obviously, but obviously it was a, still the it was a plant with a bit of distance there, so it's never easy not to uh, not to make out. It was easy, but just for someone of Mark's uh, ability. Uh, oh, see. Instead of drift, instead of drifting up for the top. Oh, could you not? I thought you could. Sorry. Okay. I don't know, I could get to it, but I'd have I, I, I killed the ball and played it. I mentioned that. I mentioned that when I said it. Here we go, Coop. Now, man, let me just swap my cues over. Had a great break from Sean. Sure. Alright, mate. Big opportunity to put some, put some tang back in this match. Let's have a look, sir. I like reds, but we've got to deal with this one here. Um, let's formulate a plan for this red now, then we can decide what we're going to do through this. Through. So um, it's a tricky one because when it's where it's on, we need to clear this block at first. Um, I'm wondering now, actually, if we yeah, go ahead. Well, what I'm thinking, we'd, we'd, I like the idea exactly what I was just thinking too. So we go this one here. We'll come into here. Yep. Right. If we, if we, if we, ideally, if we, if, we, if we could get thin on this ball here while these two reds are still here. Right. So we've got margin for error on our first shot. Right. If we say we overrun it down there, we can still continue. Yep. Right. If you land perfect, you nick it in. Well, we've got these two balls to land on. Right. So, oh, sorry, go ahead. I 
That's right, mate. That's right. That's right. You got to bridge that. You got to bridge that shot on the table. The bridge is far too long for that shot to um, to control it. I mean, you got six, seven inches of cue in front of you. you know what I mean, just put your hand on the table there. That's all it is. That's all it is. So obviously the. Uh, so obviously the reds here, Mark. I mean, this isn't easy, but I mean, to get in this, the yellows, unless we can spring all these out now, which I don't see an easy starter and an easy way to get on these. We use the two reds here. I think stand back. We try and get rid of these reds now before they try and dominate the pocket. It's just trying to find a way anywhere here. Hello, mate. Little technicals yeah. it's all this. Anywhere here. Bigger picture. Again, it's going to be hard. We could, we could we could play a bit of side, and we could slide the ball over. And either cut. Yeah. Yeah. I'd rather not leave that to last as well, which is frustrating. But yeah, oh, I thought you could see this. Could you not? Or am I all over the place? You don't see that? Yeah. You can't, yeah. Uh, yep, I'm happy because we need to deal with this. Yep. Try and leave something nice there. At least we can run on into that. Even if we get on this first, we might be. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Not easy, this. I have to try and play a good shot to get down the bottom of the table here and deal with these two. That yellow, is, that yellow is so close to me. Yeah, just imagine I'm here, the white ball's there. You've got all this cue to move, right? Put your hand here. Six inches, you know what I mean? Tall it is, mate. You never miss that. You, you, you put that a thousand out of a thousand with your hand on the table. You've got the same issue as us, the same challenge as us to try and deal with that ball down there. I'd be interested to see which way they go. Yourself on the plan there because the plan pushes the object, the second ball to the, or so the first ball to the slow cushion. So he's lining up the plan, he's lining up the plan, but I don't think he can play that. <laughs> Every one of Scotty's that looks like Jory goes in, doesn't it? <laughs> right speed. Mark's looking eager as we were to try and deal with that ball. Yeah. And now they're, now they're sort of three, three balls into the out. They're getting, it's getting the time where it has to happen. Yeah. I suppose we're hoping that Benzema stuck, didn't it? You know, He's our, he's, our, he's our second chance. I'm lucky, mate. We'll probably have to we'll look at taking this yellow and just clipping. You can clip it, right, and come here with a choice of three. And just, yeah. The plant actually grows as well. The plant grows as well if you do get a chance to get Towards the side cushion. Gives it a little bit more safety and a little bit more safety. Very important if you can get those little shots. Just killing the opponent's ball, just making a difficult level of the clearance, the counter clearance, a lot easier. Uh, yellow's still not great for, for Sean Cooper at the bottom as well. You can see how many our two reds are, so the first one to play a good developing shot down there. Probably gain advantage this thing. Two yellows at the top of the table. Both go at the top left. So. Yep, trying to control the pocket. Shot, mate. Great shot. Great shot. Didn't nice pull up. 
you trying to bother you trying to play start to play mm. nice well, well done Do you know what? Do you know what, Mark? If you do, if you do land, if you do land this side of it, you can play. I think the red and squeezing off the jaw. It's a great shot. Mate. It's, it's fighting Q. But makes what's hard. Makes what's been hard the whole frame even harder again for us. Yeah, it's good. We can get to this. Look, we're on the way here anyway, so we can get to this. I'm trying to position. That would probably keep the end as well. Mm. I think it's me to play. So I think if I come, uh, if I try and get her now. Or I could try and cause chaos, but I don't see the benefit. I could, I could screw that down here, because but all I think I might do is open the frame up for them. Do you want to? If you can get the arm back, closer. Yep. Okay. Then I can. What's that, Mark? A bit of running left hand side in between the two yellows, or do you want me to stun back? I can screw back and maybe into here somewhere. Yeah, even if you can screw back to here. Well, I can't. Well, that's going to be very tricky. Cause I'm, oh yeah, okay. Yep, yep, yep. I'll do that. Yep. Okay. Just trying to leave Mark a nice angle here. Getting these two balls. Okay, today. okay, that's time you morning. It was, a little, it was a little bit more sensible last night. It helped it. <laughs> I was trying to leave Mark a much better angle than that there. Just maybe a couple of inches short there. And give him something to work with. Sort of resign now to screwing this in, trying to leave this yellow. I'm going to try and pinch it. Oh, another, another there, by the way. Usually a trademark. So you get the fruits of your labour. Right, mate. Mm. Yeah. Michael Tab, Dave Vickers, top table, please. What do you think? I don't know. We can play. Off the rail. Pop that. Come up the street. What do you reckon? Is that what we're doing? Or do you want it? Do you want another shot in mind? Do you want it on Q2 well? Or should I come up here and play long? We've got we've got the protection still to come down here and work out this a little bit differently. It just it just presents us with a chance to although it's tricky here, so um I might actually play I might actually play the tricky one first. Yeah. Well, let's have let's have a look. What what are you what are you thinking? Because, yeah, okay. Um, if we're going to move it though, if we're going to move it, we may as well pull it, come down here, you know what I mean? Because then we've got to. Dislodge this ball. Just, just move it a bit. Let's leave an angle where he can run into the yellow at the bottom of the table. Show me yellow. It's pretty good. I think Coop sees the roll in here. Just nudge that ball. It's alright. Just, just move. move on. Them both. It's not frozen. I've done it. 
everything's alright with the sound. Tuck this behind that yellow. Four or three. Top, top. Mmm. Now it just depends what way you want to go. So I can, I can try and punch out, try and tuck it there I, can, it, I, I think yeah, actually for, the, for the security of what we're doing, just stand out, try and leave you an angle high so you can screw off the cushion and come back up. Do you think? On the black, yeah, and lucky enough, even if we're behind it, you can just pinch it down and the, at the least agree we've got a shot on the black to the corner. I'm just trying to figure out what angle you want here, because if I come, if I finish low side, you're going to have to go through and we're going to leave the long one. Yeah. So I'm really trying to finish high side. Something here or, or even straight. Straight you can you can stand back here and I think you can play a little bit of reverse side. <laughs> Easy for me to say. <laughs> and then obviously uh, even even a tad high but then we're worried about snookering ourselves. Although we have always got this but we don't really can't really link up to the next ball. So it's just a case of... Yeah. Yeah, sweet. And even if, if worst case scenario, just just roll that in deadly. Just make sure we've a shot on this. Yeah, okay, okay, mate. Thing I said I wouldn't. Rubbish. Rubbish. That's a case of sorry, pardon. A fourth yet, pardon. Sorry, mate. Let's keep, keep it going. It's your shot, isn't it? What are you thinking? Wait, what's the thing? Are you going to nick thin off it and try and set it behind, or are you going to play it with top? So you come around, you to come across, what's, what's wrong? What's wrong with just coming around here? What's wrong with coming across thin, just, just nip it thin and nip it nestled in behind there? Because any, you know what I mean? Just, just clip off, just clip off this thin, and just drift it into here. You know what I mean, rather than play top, because the top's going to run this ball and disturb theirs. And, you know, if you don't get it, it's just nice thin, nice and true. Play the shot when you're ready. Lovely, mate. Lovely, lovely shot. Lovely shot. It's interesting, you play, you can play it with top. Right, just but, um, screw this one's angle a little bit. Yeah, no matter what happens, it's going to be on this one. Yeah, um, I mean, I've seen the angle have got here. I've seen people. We could drop, try and drop. Obviously, it's a low percentage. We could try and drop the red playing ball down, down in towards the pocket. But it's low percentage. You, you, nine times out of ten, you leave the, you leave the the balls on. I could try and play off the right hand side of the red, and do the same thing you did. Swing the white ball around the angles. You know, try and almost. Do you reckon there's angle there to try and squeeze this in behind? I mean, yeah, I, I could. The white ball's going to be flying, especially towards that middle right pocket. Uh, I don't really know, other than playing at playing ball, I don't fancy the 
I, if, if you play this up and down, if it, if it does go, then we're yeah, but not on that anyway. The only thing I could do is play the same shot you played, but I come off the right hand side of the, of the red and try and swing the ball around the angles again. Though with the pace I'm playing it, I might go in off and I might just leave this easy one here anyway. Yeah. Uh, I, 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 yeah, if you fan, if you think, and I could just try and drop that, but the white ball's going to be running. I might go in off. Yep, you're quite happy well, for me. That's why I played the shadow I play because we were in trouble. Yep. Um, I don't think there's any other. Yep. Like, even if, even, if, even if I don't even get it in behind the yellow, somehow I land it short and it goes in front of the yellow. So, yeah, it's still down here and it causes, some sort of it causes a problem there. Yeah. Yeah. Yep, no worries. Yeah. <coughs> Somewhere just off middle, middle, slightly left. Just about the pace. Sneak it across. I don't want to move. I don't want to move the yellow next to the red. Yeah. What do you reckon? I'm gonna, I'm gonna, it's going to go. It's going to go into the red, but it might knock it over to the other side. You know what I mean? Develop the frame. If I just if I just tap the red strip, leave the white on the cushion. Yep. So you'd have to get behind it. It doesn't go. You'd have to get behind it, Mark. Yeah. Are you bothered really bad? What are you going to do with the red? Where's the red going to be? Just on. Yeah. Just this. Yeah. If you. Yeah. That's cool. Get the up here. Yep. I like it. Play. Yep. Um, at least if he leaves us down here, we have this one. Yeah. He leaves us up here. Up here. Yep. It's all about just getting away. Yep. I. Yep. Perfect. Yep. Sounds good. Mark's going to try and roll this ball through. Make sure he, uh, he leaves the ditches the the white on the side of the table and behind the yellow, and that stops the stops the chance of the finish. It's all about the white ball here, it's not about the object ball. It's a good shot, really good shot. He's also left the red in the middle. Oh, here, Coops. Yeah. I think, I think, we just, you just clip off, it's fine. Even if it's, I mean, it's not a complete snooker, as long as we're leaving on this end, so have a look here, right? No, to be, to be honest, I, I fancy just to nip, tip off this one and just nestle in. The yellow will move across the fraction and you just nestle on the cushion, just a little bit of touch, you know what I mean? Move a snooker, okay? Take your time on the sh and all that. Lovely touch, mate. Lovely touch. Nice, mate. I don't think it's quite a total, but it's, it's, um, it's a good shot. Side cushion, and you just make sure that you, you bury the line of this ball in between the two. Yeah, I'm thinking the same thing. If you if you flick off that, just snicker. Mm -hmm. So of course you use the black as a stopper. Yeah. So aim 
you obviously have to pace it right. You yes. just want to drop in. You don't yep. really want to hit the black, but I mm -hmm. aim for the black just in case yep. it is a little bit pacey. Yep. But you're literally just sneaking off it. Yeah, and it might, and I'll actually promote the red and maybe leave it portable. But yeah, the white's the important issue here. It's not the object ball. Yeah, yeah book it. Top pace in this one. Yep. so much though. So I've got a lot of angle right so I've got to try and check it but it's going to be going to be quite high but then if it land a bit too high for you you can always bring it out in the middle right you know what I'm saying so I've got, I've got to play this one first right I'll probably land about here right so then you've got two choices you can either just try and drop it in certainly land here or you can play it with confidence you know what I mean get me out here on the bike. What a super touch, mate. Super touch. Hold on, Shawnee. Stuff. Let's get around the toilet, Sean. Yeah, mate, no stress. No. All right, so... Um, <laughs> Let's go nip the toilet, we're back in a minute. Tell you what, to get this back to 4 3 minutes, we've done really well. Um, you know, we've started to release a couple of extra chances there, which is nice, but we finished. That's a lovely touch, mate. I'll tell you one, one thing one thing we didn't do is, uh, and I didn't realise until we, we um, until I got them to that black, we didn't have a look because, in actual fact, <laughs> it was on through there. <laughs> so we could have just, yeah, but it's just, just a bit of a. Bit of a one for the ones at home there, we didn't have a proper look, but uh, Pacuz played a fantastic touch shot there to um, to just drop that in, and that's the first one you've played too, as Jordan actually dropped in. Good time for it, good time for it. Um, so yeah, so the boys are just taking a toilet break, we'll get the balls out for them. Um. So um, as far as things go, I'm pretty happy to be in the match still here. We face... Uh, we face uh, their break. If we can get to the table in this frame, we could be, you know, we work our way to, we could, we could be breaking into the cider. So that's uh, something to aim for. Um, we've, made, we've made more mistakes than them and we are only 4-3. Um, so I think, uh, I think I'd take that because we're still in the match. And uh, the good thing is that they, they still know we're here too. You know, and um, yeah, things tighten up a little bit. Who knows? But uh, yeah, now um, obviously today's Thursday. It's a big day's play. We've got the round of doubles this morning, and then uh, 4:45 today for the open is the quarterfinals of the singles. We've got uh, four Victorians in the quarterfinals of the singles: myself, Mark Owens, Sean Walpole, Jack Green. Um, so that's a pretty good showing and uh, then the next round of the doubles follows that and then later this evening the semi-finals of the singles so it's a big big day of pool today uh, for those still in all these events and, um, and obviously in between sessions you have masters and seniors and ladies as well similar actions so heaps going on today uh, I think we've got two days of play left after today this is the third last day um, Yes, and uh, fatigue's kicking in, but uh, the pool's getting better. So we um, should see some good, good pool during the final series. The teams and for singles. 
Well, good, mate. A little bit disappointed Scotty didn't take the mic to the toilet with him. Uh, yeah, well, hey? Scott, could have heard the power they were having in the toilet. <laughs> hey? It's yours, I believe. Done. All good. All right. So yep. what we're looking for here is uh, just an opportunity, so, aren't we? We've got a four-all decider. Just the way it should be for match size. It's four-all, I think. Is it not? It's a four-three. Sorry. Oh, apologies, boys. I thought it was four-four. Sorry, I, I got a lot. I got ahead of myself. Yeah, it's all right. yeah I thought it was your break. You just thought I was an idiot coming up, shake your hand there. <laughs> You'll be looking for the concede. We'll be four-all in it. <laughs> That's how, good, that's, that's how sporting we are in Victoria, man. We wish yeah. each other to shake our hands free frame every frame. <laughs> Too early in the morning for me, I think. Well, Coops, asking we shall receive. We Jeez. have an opportunity, mate. What do you think? Oh, great break, mate. I don't like reds. I like reds. Um, because I'm, what I'm thinking is we do it, we do this, we, do, we deal with this one, this one, this one, and we finish on the three. What do you reckon? All right. Do you want to play or do you want me to play? Uh, All right. to switch the other red here, but it's all right. It's all right, mate. Once, once I don't screw it back there, take the one. In the Masters 1130 game, tables 10 and 11, CQ crushes versus on cue. It's all right. Unfortunately, the two balls aren't, aren't in a great... What's the angle you've got here? I've got something. It's annoying because I don't really want to. I don't really want to float this in because I, I'm running into my, my work and it's all it all goes at the moment. Unless I try and touch into the second ball, I might I might promote it past the red though. Do you know why we bit aside running the second ball? I can, play, I can play it with Stan and I can play it with roll through and it would come in and it would, t it would hit the top of the second ball. Yeah, I think you're yeah. this one. Yeah. I think and you need to play playing this this one here, down here, or if you get the angle to come up, dropping that in and then coming down. But it's still hard. We need, we, need to, we need to be good in it. That's what I'll try and do. I'm going to try and play this first one and I'll try and just, and I'll try and just cannon into the, the second ball. This one here. Yeah. And even if I play it with pace... At least if you do get that... I might close that off. Yeah. I just, I just worry if I don't play it hard enough, it might drift up here to the middle and kill it. Do you know what I mean? Try, yeah, try and even, yeah, try and go for this. this one here. Yeah. It's really important that if this doesn't work out, like this, this is a tough, it's a tough thing. Yeah. This one, if we can take that pocket. Yeah. The puck's down. Yeah. Right. Okay. Yeah, just make sure I deliver the Q arm here. Good. Just try to pinch, just try to pinch that a wee bit so I could control the weight. And lost focus on the pot. All right. We're back to our original plan, aren't we? All right. But we've got to be careful here. Yeah. 
I've got to sort of screw this a bit. I want to try and drift into this gap, but I don't want, I don't want to come down here and disturb this one. You know, it's pretty thin. You know what I mean? So I'm going to cut this one in, try and screw through this gap here. If I clamp into one of these, so be it. But you know what I mean? I don't want to come down here. And, so I'm going to pot this, screw the white through here. All right? Yep. All right, we put back to the table here unexpectedly. Shot. I think this is going he's going to have to play the stun shot here. Stun up off the top cushion. Try and leave himself, I think, anyway. Yeah, yeah, from an angle here, you can see. And then stun, stun back to the side rail. Leave Cooper a difficult one. I don't know, he's got enough, he, he's not getting off so on. So he can just drop it in, leave himself on the side, top, top side. They try and leave Cooper a good angle. It's all about the queuing from Cooper here. Sure. Flew off off that, I thought I overhit it, but uh, he's on. A good test. It's a very good sign to see how he's feeling here. Very difficult shot. To try and get a nice, nice position on the black as well. So a few things to deal with here. Big shot. I take it though. Sort of smashed that, 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 tough shot that was. Hello, mate. He's managed to leave it sort of covered though. It's just top second right prize, it's for sure. You top it through. You mean? Mm. You looked at it. You lined yeah. up. I'd love top, to get these out of the way now, Mark. Yeah. But just you got to top it through and come in the middle of the table there, and just to give us a chance to run it. Yeah. Um. Listen, Mark. If, listen, the the, the 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 balls go. So let's get a snooker. Let's try and get a snooker up here. Even if Sean does hit the red and make contact with the red, he's then going to open the pocket up for the the two balls going down. Yeah. Now, if he does make contact with the red, we've always got this yellow here as a nice first starter. If he wants to ditch the white down the bottom, yeah. and obviously the two yellows go at the top, depending where he leaves the yellow and the red. If he gets the hit on it, and obviously if he gives us the two shots, we can try and. Remember, if he does, if he doesn't make contact and we get the two shots and he leaves the red there, we just pick up the ball, play it here, and kill the red up to the side cushion, yeah, and yeah. we start. We've got the finish there anyway, so it doesn't really matter if he gets that. We just need a good snooker here. Okay. Yep. Now angle here to get the pot angle. Yep. Uh, he actually doesn't really have an angle here, really, so it's going to be difficult. Yep. So, anyway, if we can land anywhere around here. Yep, okay. 
there's me to go, he broke, didn't you? Oh jeez, so it's two tuned in in the game here. Uh, hold on a second. Yeah, that's right, yep. We'll just try to work out who it was there. <laughs> Conveniently forgot about that miss I did at the start of the frame. Lucky there wasn't a ball when I dropped that. I just did. Try to off this round, just swing it. Turtle. Just a point, man. If I left him up there, he could have swung it off to the side real and pet him. Not at all what I wanted. I'll just start to fit up the cushion, maybe. Just a reminder, in the yeah, teams, we are timing matches. I think there's a Do start and match. You play, team, you, can you play the red ball off the match. yellow and leave the red if in the bottom cushion? catch any team so, not timekeeping, it will be a frame drop a per team. You can actually play in a more confident way. And leave that just on the side. Also, now it's always better for go that cushion. It's always better to go that cushion. Let's have a look at the angle, please. Remember, we've got the two shots though, so you can't, you don't have to pot the yellow on this shot. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you're going to hit a cushion. I'd say just make sure you just drop that red to the bottom cushion. It just completely freezes. If we leave this on the side cushion, they can just stand it on the side cushion, and the black still goes. It just completely nullifies the chance that it takes the co the, the pressure off. Okay. Yep. Yep. Shot, Scotty. <coughs> Mark wasn't happy with uh, where he left his, but left to do it. Scotty's played a good recovery. And uh, they set him up is that mate. But it's been a good match. But, uh, we'll stay ready just in case. Lovely shot. Lovely shot. Fight a bit of attention on that one. Just to make sure the black was you know, promoted. Well done, well done Mark. Excellent, lads. Really enjoyed that. Yeah, I like you, Cooper. Like you, Sean. Well done, mate. Yeah, really enjoyed that. Thank you. Nice one, Mark. Well Thank done. You.
Thanks for having me, mate. Really enjoyed that, guys. Just a couple of mistakes. Yeah, really enjoyed that. It was good fun. De decent uh, standard game, I think. Though. Fun. Next match on table number two in the Masters.